G'day, John from One Black Dog Rides here. I had a bit of a problem the other day. Want to have a guess what it was? Yeah, the battery. Here is the poor old thing. So how many volts does it have? One day I'll work this all out. Okay, voltmeter. Untangle cables. Red to red, black to black. Turn it on. So that looks alright. So that doesn't look too bad. For volts anyway. But does it have any grunt to actually start the bike? That is the big question. Okay, let's put the battery back in. Odyssey fits nicely on its side. If you use positive to the bottom, you don't need to actually bring in any new wiring. It'll all just a uh, little bit of rerouting and it will fit. So I do normally have some spaces in there, some uh, sheets of vinyl, but I'll leave those out just while we test. And of course, the joys of working outside is, uh, means it wants to try and rain right now. Okay. Cables in firmly. Okay, neutral, choke, safety. And that ain't gonna start. Just once more for good measure. And that is what a dead battery sounds like. And now that it's raining, it's time to go back in. Storm due in half an hour or so. Let's go. Had a feed. Watch some Peter McKinnon videos on how to do this. And um, let's do it. Where are the tools? Where's my brain? Okay, take this cover off. Testing the battery. Grab the key. Okay, we're all set. Hmm, that doesn't work. Let's try it that way. We're on. We're not happening. Okay, just to prove it's the battery and not anything else, grab a spare battery and grab jumper legs. So, after a trip out west when somebody's battery died in the middle of nowhere, I thought I better get myself some jumper leads. Because uh, that day we were a couple of hours from nowhere. Okay, so jumper leads. Battery. Here we go. Battery. Set of Anderson plugs. All set, all connected in. Anderson plugs connected. 
things tangled. So let's try again. Battery on, clutch in. Right, clutch in. Hasn't run for a while, probably flooded it. Wrong button. At least it's turning. At least it's turning. I took it to the shop and had it tested. Plenty of volts, but 60. 60 cold cranking amps is what the load tester gave showed. It's meant to have 150, but it measured 60. So, no good. So I bought a new one. I bought another one of these. Okay, old battery, four years old, that's all. Only the four, and off it goes for recycling. New battery, been sitting on charge for a while. Take it off, and how many volts has it got? Thirteen point six. Pretty similar for volts, but let's go and see the difference when it comes to starting this beast up. All wired in. Let's try it again. Wired in, on, still a bit of choke. And that, kids, is how it's meant to start. So what was the problem? How do you go and kill an Odyssey battery? Well, the first one lasted four months. I think that got shaken apart on a trip out west. This one, I think the culprit was the USB. There's plenty of times where I ride irregularly. So we get flat. So there's a USB up the front and another one in the top box. So I've now taken the fuse out so it doesn't have its parasitic draw and this one is now on a switch on off because there's also another 12 volt there. So hopefully I'll now have a battery that lasts a long long time. Fingers crossed problem solved. Of course, it's always worth checking that theory. So, milliamps draw. Zero, 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 zero. Okay, point two, point three, point one, zero, zero, point two. Okay, that's with the disconnected and switched off. Put the fuse back in.
switch the front one back on. Ignition is still off. And what do we get? Ooh. Much the same. What does that mean? This confuses me. Sometimes I think all I know is just enough to be dangerous. To think I might know something, but I actually don't. So, um, yeah. That's all a bit confusing. I was hoping it would show a number. Does it do anything to voltage? Maybe that'll change something. Okay, off. Fuse out. Voltage. Oh, that doesn't make any bloody sense, does it? Four volts. Switch it off. Back on again. Plugged in. DC. Four volts. What the? Oh, God. Okay, plenty of light. Plenty of grunt to start. LED voltmeter says green, which is good. Oh, some days. Off. Let's test this spare battery. It says 4.8 as well. That says 4.8. Red's at the bottom, black at the top. Yeah, about 4.8. Bugger it. <laughs> 